Hi everyone. I just thought that um, I'd do a little introduction video. Um, starting tomorrow, uh, my family is going to be embarking on something that is on our plan for tomorrow, which is the Kids Run Club. So Kids Run Club um, is usually offered in the springtime. Usually I'll just do something simple because in the fall I end up running my all my cross country runs. This year we were going to do a big one and unfortunately we can't do it um, at the school but hopefully you'll participate with your families outside of school. Um, anybody that participates um, could you please or is going to try to participate in the Kids Run Club that is offered by Doctors Nova Scotia and several other partners are part of it. Um, if you could send me a quick email just to let me know um, that you are participating. If you take any photos, I'd love to see that. But I'd like to know how many students are trying the run. There are finisher prizes um, at the end of the eight weeks for any students. Um, but as you know, we don't have eight weeks of school left. So when our that last week that we are um, in lessons, that June 5th week, um, anybody that has participated, when as soon as I get those finisher prizes, I will make sure that I do a curbside drop off to all of you. All right, so Kids Run Club. Um, there's a link to a PDF document um, on my Monday uh, plan for this week, but also if you go into my printable pages, you will find this document, okay? Um, on the document, there is some tables and some information, okay? Basically, what I want you to know today is that what they're, uh, what they're suggesting is that families um, try doing this run and picking a distance that you would like to get to at the end of the eight weeks, or even if you want to just try it until June 5th. All right, what do you think a reasonable distance would be? And then it's set up to for your family to run three times a week. All right, and basically, depending on what level you think your family may be at, all right, there are different levels to start at. So um, if I look on the sheet right now, it says 0.5 of a kilometer. Um, maybe starting if you are, if you believe maybe that you'd like to only run a shorter distance at the end. And if you'd like to run a farther distance, you'll notice that it says, start at running start at running at 1.5 kilometers all right for your first run all right and you'll notice that there's three runs per week and it gives you the full eight weeks and how far you should be running for each okay so again there's no need to send me your progress or how far you made it um, but I would love to know if you're trying this out it doesn't matter what three days a week that you do it um, I'll always do an update on Monday and I'll do a little conversation about run tips like things to wear if you get a side stitch what to do um, maybe if you're having trouble going on hills what are some things you can do to help yourself as well as going down hills um, there's all kinds of different things that you can try with your stride all right i just wanted to make this um, hopefully um, as outdoorsy um, getting that fresh air that we need for our minds as well as our bodies and i'm hoping that so many of you participate and that when we get back in the fall that we can continue with our cross country races and that maybe even more of you will join our club. All right, have a great week everyone and stay tuned. There's some big news coming this week um, about a special thing I'll be doing.